Welcome to Spectrum Health TV. I'm joined by Dr. Andre Gori, a cardiologist who specializes in electrophysiology at Spectrum Health. Welcome, Dr. Gori. Thank you for having me, Carrie. What is an electrophysiologist? An electrophysiologist is a cardiologist that specializes in heart rhythm problems, also known as arrhythmias. And what are the symptoms of arrhythmias? Arrhythmias can present themselves in a variety of ways, uh, most typically palpitations or rapid heartbeat that a patient feels. It could also be lightheadedness, dizziness, passing out. And what are the treatments? The treatments for arrhythmias um, are threefold, uh, medications, device therapy, and a procedure called an ablation. What is an ablation? An ablation is a procedure where we insert catheters, typically through the legs, up into the patient's heart under x-rays and target abnormal areas of the heart where the arrhythmia or fast heartbeat is originating from. So how many ablations does Spectrum Health perform? Currently at Spectrum Health, we do over 600 a year, which on a national level is quite high volume. You mentioned device therapy. What does that consist of? Device therapy consists of uh, two things, pacemakers and also devices called defibrillators. And can you explain what those are and what the difference is? Sure. Um, I actually have two examples here. This is a pacemaker. It's a device a little bigger than a um, half dollar. It gets placed under the skin in the chest area and there's wires that attach to the device and then go into the heart. And what is that used for? That's used to treat patients who have slow rhythms. And then what about a defibrillator? A uh, defibrillator is a device that is similar to a pacemaker. It's a little larger in size. It also gets placed under the skin in the chest area with wires that then go into the heart. And how effective are both of these devices? The devices are quite effective. Uh, defibrillators are typically used to treat patients with life-threatening cardiac arrhythmias or to prevent something called sudden cardiac death, which is the leading killer of people in the United States. Well, I appreciate you sharing this information with us. Thank you for having me. And thank you for joining us for this edition of Spectrum Health TV.